In question number seven, we're asked to solve the inequalities three minus eight x is greater than four for two marks, and the quantity two x minus four multiplied by the quantity x minus three is equal to or less than 12 for five marks. So we have a linear inequality in the first part. I'm going to add eight x to both sides of the inequality and subtract four. So I'm going to have minus one is greater than eight x, Dividing both sides by 8, we'll have minus 1 over 8 is greater than x. So, two marks for the first part of question 7. In the second part, I'm going to go ahead and expand the brackets. Expanding the brackets, we'll have 2x squared minus 6x minus 4x plus 12 will be equal to or less than 12. We can subtract 12 from both sides of the inequality and collect like terms. We'll have 2x squared minus 10x is going to be equal to or less than 0. I can factor this and taking out now the common factor of 2x. We'll have 2x and then we'll have x minus 5 and that will be equal to or less than 0. Considering the critical values, we'll have now 0 and 5. I'm just going to draw a quick sketch. You certainly don't have to, but this might help you out. And then we can go ahead and solve this inequality. So what we're going to have then is the critical value just here. That's going to be 0, and we're going to have 1 just here at 5. So drawing the parabola, we're interested in this now, where it's going to be equal to or less than 0. So let's just put these points here. This is where we have zero. It's equal to or less than zero in this particular region. So we can say that x will be equal to or greater than zero. And in turn, we can say x will be equal to or less than five. So that solves the inequality for part two and we score five marks for doing that.